Sri Jay Kumar Sharon is a successful agripreneur from Karnal, Haryana. After his retirement from the Haryana State Agricultural Department as Agricultural Development Officer in 1998, he ventured into beekeeping in the year 2014. Today, he is a successful bee man from this area. He has also completed his AC and ABC training program from ISIP Karnal. He keeps the bees in boxes and he has more than 600 boxes. The boxes are placed in areas where crops such as mustard, araha, sunflower, bajra, cotton and barsim are grown. Boxes are also placed amidst eucalyptus and acacia trees. Around 150 to 200 boxes are placed in each location. November to March is the peak season during which he gets honey from eucalyptus and mustard. From April to October, which is considered off-season, he gets honey from other crops mentioned earlier. From each box, approximately 40 kgs of raw honey is collected every year. The raw honey is sold to traders or exporters for further processing, packaging and marketing. Each colony of honeybee is structured in a complicated fashion. Each box or colony contains three different types of bees. The one and only queen bee is prominently large in size and exists along with approximately 100 numbers of drones or males and around 15 to 20,000 worker bees. Life in a bee's colony too is extremely complicated. The drone or the male, after mating with the queen in mid-air, falls down and dies. The queen lays eggs which are either male or female. The male eggs develops into workers while the female eggs, if fertile, develops into females or the queen and if infertile, develops into males or the drones. The lifespan of worker bees is about 40 to 60 days, whereas the drones or the males live up to 90 days or till the time of mating. The queen bee lives for about one and a half to three years. Besides honey, which is the main product, bee wax, pollen, propolis, bee venom, and royal jelly are the other byproducts that can be harvested from a bee colony. These byproducts are in huge demand due to their excellent nutritional and medicinal properties. Fluctuating honey prices and the difficulty in extracting, processing, and storing of byproducts are the bottlenecks in bee rearing, says Mr. J. Kumar Sharon. However, his attempts are directed at removing these bottlenecks and in making beekeeping much more profitable and risk-free venture.